Yeah, such a sad story as we continue to learn more and more about each one of these five victims and there were reminders everywhere here around Aurora as well as right behind me here at Henry Pratt Manufacturing of those victims. Five bouquets of flowers sit right out in front of the doors where those five people used to work. Now, this is what we do know about those victims. These are photos that family members have shared with us of the five killed when a gunman opened fire inside of the Henry Pratt Company warehouse. Investigators tell us four of the Pratt employees were sitting in on an exit meeting with the gunman when he started shooting moments after he found out he lost his job. Trevor Wayner, a 21-year-old Northern Illinois University student, had just started his internship at Henry Pratt on the day of the shooting. He was only in the building for a few hours before he was gunned down. Clayton Parks was the HR resource manager at Pratt. He's an NIU alumni. The 32 year old leaves behind a heartbroken wife and infant. Russell Byer, a father of two, worked at Pratt for more than 20 years. He was a union rep for the company and people tell us he was a very close friend of all the employees here. He was sitting in on that meeting as well with the gunman. Josh Pinkard, a father of three kids and dedicated husband, worked as the plant manager. He was a man of strong faith and a lover of Mississippi State sports. 55-year-old Vicente Juarez was a loving husband with three kids and eight grandchildren. His large family all lives just a few miles away in Oswego. His family tells me they waited for hours to find out if he was coming home. I left and I called my dad, I called my dad, he wouldn't answer, I called my dad, I went to the emergency room asking them, do you guys have my dad, nope. Hard to not break down yourself when you hear these emotional interviews with these family members who waited so long to find out if their family members were going to make it out of work on Friday. Then shortly finding out this tragic news, our thoughts remain with those family members of these five victims. Also, this entire area here in Aurora, right outside of the manufacturing company, expected to be very crowded around 2.30 this afternoon when community members, family and friends, and other employees of Pratt come out to show their support for those families and honor the memory of these victims. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.